The aliens are back at it again, folks. For years and years, we've wondered, is there life outside of Earth? There have been UFO sightings for decades and decades and decades. And even last year, this year, the United States government even recognized that yes, there are aliens. And then there was that weird little little alien from Mexico or something. Yeah, these little guys. <laughs> but today we're talking about a new alien sighting. This actually just came out on TikTok last night, or well, I saw it first on TikTok last night. Apparently there was a 10 foot alien spotted outside a mall in Miami. An incident at a Miami shopping mall which resulted in- wait, hold on, I can't read that fast. Resulted in the arrest of four teenagers on January 1st has sparked the spread of a bizarre theory. Wow, look at all the detail in that photo, dude. Suggests the alleged presence of aliens at the Florida establishment. More than 60 police cars swarmed the Bayside Marketplace in downtown Miami. Wait, why? To shut down a fight involving a group of teenagers who are also throwing fireworks at each other in an open air shopping mall. So this is the thing that people are getting all crazy about because there were so many cop cars. Let's get a more reliable source. Let's go to TikTok. <laughs> Miami alien footage, three different angles. From Patriot Ghost, you know that we can trust them. See, the government is even shutting down my internet. They know that I'm onto something. They understand. They know that I'm about to find something huge. The little FBI guy, my little FBI guy, his name is James. He knows I'm up to something. He knows I'm, a, I'm on the precipice with Patriot Ghost. This is supposed to be the alien. It's supposed to be 10 feet tall. Mom said, that just looks like a dude. <laughs> just looks like a guy. <laughs> the FBI is out of the gate. James, just let me make my video, please. This is what you can do on Opera GX when you don't have internet. Kind of sick. Opera GX, can you sponsor me, please? Thank you. Shocking how <laughs> all of this footage is horrific. That, okay, so this looks like multiple people. This just looks like multiple people walking. Why are people saying it's an alien? A reason why a bunch of people were like, this is an alien is because people were like, why would they send this many cops? Why would they send so many police officers just to stop some kids from fighting with fireworks? I mean, look at all those police cars. Oh, this is the real one. Guys, this is the real deal. This is the real deal. 10 feet tall my ass. This is a whole ass tight. That's just a guy. That's a five foot eight white guy just standing in a parking lot. The alleged alien in Miami. Damn, that looks real, dude. High the res image. Out of Miami at the moment is super, super concerning, okay? They are clearly trying to cover up something from us. They sent every single police car that they had in the area to the mall to deal with some teenagers that were fighting with sticks, okay? And 10 foot tall alien. I don't the understand. Deleted and removed by the men in black, but some people were able to get huh? this footage. Huh? Wait, what? what? The men in black? Some people were able to get this footage of what witnesses are describing as six foot tall gray aliens. Wait, now hold on. Is it six feet? Or is it 10 feet? Are we talking about dudes lying about their height on Tinder? I was told 10 foot tall aliens. I want them to be 10 feet tall. Six foot tall aliens is fucking whatever. And they're probably not even six feet. They're probably 5'10 or 5'9. Now, obviously the footage that we have here is very low res. It's very pixelated, but I actually have access to an AI service that can help up res the images so we can see what was actually going on here. I'm sure this will be good. I'm sure this will be good and reliable and will give us the real scoop on what's going on. You ready? Let's see what's actually going on. Holy shit. <laughs> you had me! No, hold on. I thought that this I thought that this person was completely serious. Oh, that's so good. I want Crazy Frog to be real so bad. Hold on, let's go to goodolx.com. Because we want the ground, we don't want the news articles. We want the ground footage. Who, okay, who is believing this? Who is believing this? Who is actually believing that? That looks so bad. Also, again, everything is like blurry. Like phones are better these days. Bro, bro, everyone's going this way. 
Who is believing this footage? Yo, yo, what is that? What is what? What are you looking at? None of this look speed. Re what is this footage? No one's phone looks like this. <laughs> so stupid. Oh man. Miami is done for. Miami is absolutely done for, dude. Okay, here we go. Here's the video that a lot of people are looking at. It's this thing right here, okay? That's what people are thinking is the alien. It's literally just three people walking. That's all it is. It's just three people walking. I know that I'm being negative here. Let me take off my uh, my tinfoil hat for a minute. Let me tell you, I want real alien footage just as much as everybody else does. I do. That would be sick and terrifying. And at this point in our good Lord's year of 2024, what's the worst thing that can happen? We're already fucked anyway. It would be sick to get real alien footage. I'd love that, but this is not it. Now, what I will say, and again, this is all of the research that I've done, so don't even think for a moment that I've done proper research because I haven't. But from what we've read today, the situation is there were four teenagers that were having some sort of either celebration with fireworks or altercation with fireworks. Supposedly four teenagers causing a ruckus. It doesn't make sense that there would be this many cop cars for such a thing unless they're responding to a shooting which i don't know if that's the case with this either i'm not sure you need to get the boy you need to get the boy um i mean to be honest i don't really know what that is but what i will say <clears throat> It's in Florida. They do rocket launches all the time at the Kennedy Space Center? Question mark. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know what that is. Looks kind of cool, though. I want it to be an alien, but I don't know. But it could just be a rocket that they're launching because I know that they do that because my dad grew up in Florida and he saw rockets launch all the time. <laughs> so funny. This is just so, like, the most obvious generic VHS overlay that I've ever seen. I don't know who's believing that that's real. It's so funny. Okay, wait. This is what I wanted to look up. I forgot about this. This is what I wanted to look up. A bunch of people are saying Project Blue Bean. I don't know what that is. What is Project Blue Bean? Vault.fbi.gov? If it's a .gov, that means it's real, right? <laughs> Project Blue Book original. Oh, this is Blue Book. Project Blue Book originally Project Blue Book was the Air Force name for a project that investigated UFO reports between 1947 and 1969. In 1989, an, or an organization calling itself the New Project Blue Book contacted the FBI. File this file consists of correspondence concerning the organization. How many pages do we have here? Only 13. Secretary of the Air Force announced the termination of Project Blue Book. Total UFO sighting. So the total between 1947 and 1969 was 12,618. And the total of unidentified was 701. What does that mean though? Like that they confirmed only 701 of those 12,600 were confirmed as unidentified. Meaning that the other basically 12,000 they figured out, oh, it was this. I don't know. I have no idea. Project Blue Beam is a cons... Conspiracy theory about supposed project whose purpose is to create an artificial second coming in order to control people. As per the alleged theory, the New World Order's purpose is to 1. Abolish all Christian and traditional religions in order to replace them with a one world religion based off the cult of man. 2. To abolish the national, all national identities and national pride in order to establish a world identity and world pride. What the f Fuck. Miami Bayside Mall aliens debunking post. January 1st, 9.30 p.m. A black Infinity and gray Kia crashed near the Northwest 5th Avenue and 177th Street, causing the vehicles to overturn with Miami Gardens Police and Miami Dade Fire Rescue Units responding to the scene. Crash vehicles struck an electric box, causing a power outage in the area. That's why 66,000... Would that really cause 66,000 homes to go out? For 40 p.m., first reports of police activity on Mayside Mall. Mentions of a 
scuff a scuffle on the Citizen app. Police arrive, people push out of the mall, but a number of people already outside begin scuffling with bystanders. Around the same time, posts emerge on X that show teenagers kicking people in the Dade area. 804 AM AM. First articles about the incident are reported and police announcements are made. Four juvenile perpetrators arrested. No flight restrictions or airport closure were actually reported or occurred, so that's a rumor, according to this. Power outage was caused by aforementioned crash. Police scanners were active and not shut down during the incident. Okay, but what the fuck? Why? Where did the alien thing come from? I don't understand. The Enderman. <laughs> it all comes down to the Enderman. On New Year's Day, a large police presence was caught on video surrounding a mall in Miami. Perhaps you saw this. A video posted online claiming it was due to an alien sighting in that area. So what really happened? Well, look at that police presence. Yeah, I know the light. Come on. Uh, Hold on. Was it 50 or was it four? We need to get our facts straight. <laughs> well, this all seems like bullshit to me. It does seem weird that there are so many police there. Um, that seems weird. And maybe, maybe a lot of people are, are conspirarizing that this is being spread because the list of the Epstein stuff has been um, has been uh, surfaced. So that could also be a thing they're trying to distract. I don't know. It's just a conspiracy theory, but it's fun. I don't know. But I wanted to make a little video about this, just talking about my thoughts and looking into it more because I saw it literally on TikTok last night. I was like, what the fuck is this? It does look to me like it's just either one person or three people. Um, I do think that people are like freaking out about it over nothing. The police presence does seem weird. Um, but yeah, you know, stranger things have happened in Florida, honestly. Um, I'll see if uh, there's more info about this soon, but it seems to just be a lot of really blurry phone footage um, and a lot of people saying a bunch of different shit. Anyway, let me know what your thoughts are. I don't even know what this video was. This was kind of all over the place. Uh, I was just looking into it and obviously looking on the best place possible for the most accurate information possible, which is on Twitter.com and TikTok. So obviously we're not getting any false information here. It's all been, you know, peer reviewed, peer edited, good research. Yeah. Anyway, see you guys on the other side. Don't get abducted by aliens. I'll see you in the next video.